In today's video, I've got five facts about Megami Fushigiro from the series Jujutsu Kaisen slash a character analysis video. We will be going over Fushigiro's bio, abilities, voice actors, some trivia, and more. Now a quick warning that there will be spoilers, so just a heads up. And for more weekly anime character fact videos, make sure to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss a video, as well as following me on Twitter to see what I'm up to next. But before we get into this video, we have a very special guest who will be lending his voice to this video. And that is Hermzar. Super excited to have him here, so let's roll intro and let him kick off the facts. Fushiguro is the deuteragonist of the series, who is a first year at Tokyo Metropolitan Cursed Technical College and is a descendant of the Zenin family. He made his debut in episode 1 of the anime and chapter 1 of the manga. Fushiguro's birthday is on the 22nd of December, which makes him a Capricorn. His exact age is unknown, though we do know that he is in his teenage years. He is pretty tall for a Japanese male standing at 5.7. Just a little bit taller than Itadori by 2 centimeters to be exact. His hair is dark black and is very spiky, quite erratic if I do say so myself, and his eyes are light green color. Attire wise, he wears the Tokyo Metropolitan Curse Technical College uniform, which consists of a black long sleeve shirt with a high collar, black trousers, and black shoes. Personality wise, Fushigiro is a guy that has been through a hell of a lot but will not express any emotion nor choose to complain about it. Now, he does come across as secretive, but it really just comes down to the fact that Fushigiro just likes to keep himself to himself and chooses not to disclose any personal information to anyone. He has a cool and calculated aura about him in which he claims to be selfish and to work only for his own desire, but just like Itadori, he does have his own wish to protect others he perceives uh, you know, to be good or kind. Fushiguro does not consider himself a hero and sees the world as unfair and believes that sorcerers are nothing but tools used to ensure that these good and kind people are given a better chance to live. His soft Side, let's say, was something he saw in Itadori, which made Fushiguro want to save him from his execution, as well as choosing not to regret this choice of his in regards to situations involving Sukuna. He does differ from Itadori's ideologies when it comes to the way he sees and, you know, speaks of the lives of let's say criminals as an example, as he sees these kind of people as not worth saving. Fushiguro's Japanese voice actor is Yuma Uchida. He has voiced other characters such as Ginshi Shirazu in Tokyo Ghoulry, Sonic Speed Monkey from Blood Blockade Battlefront, Kyo Soma in Fruit Basket, Yuma Kunimi from Bunny Girl Senpai, and more. At the time of making this video, there is no confirmation of an English dub, though we do imagine that there's going to be one. So we have no uh, information on Fushiguro's English voice actor at the moment. But if you guys have a theory on who it is, let us know in the comment section below. In terms of abilities, Fushiguro is a second grade sorcerer, one that has been said to have more potential and skill than that of Itadori. He has a lot of physical power, now not as strong as Itadori, but he is still a powerhouse. His technique of hand-to-hand -hand combat makes him stand out from the other sorcerers. However, it does make it difficult for him to utilize weapons as his curse forms require both hands for him to conjure. Now, on the topic of his cursed technique, it is called the Ten Shadows Technique, which originated from the Zenin family, where they manipulate shadows to create Shikigami and even control shadows to contain objects. Fushiguro is rather advanced in this technique and can use around eight Shikigami that we have seen anyway and I will list them here. Divine dogs are two black or white Shikigami dogs that will chase and devour curses. Nu is a Shikigami owl that attacks from the sky and is even strong enough to carry the weight of a human being. Toad summons multiple big toads that pin down his opponents using their tongues. The Well's Unknown Abyss combines the previous two Shikigami 
Ikigami, New and Toad, where the Toad gains wings. It's pretty crazy. Giant Serpent is of course a snake that will be used to surprise his enemies by attacking from the ground. Max Elephant is a large Shikigami elephant that will release large amounts of water from its trunk. Escape Rabbit summons a huge amount of rabbits that are used to distract the enemy in order to escape. Eight-handled sword divergent Scylla Divine General Mahoraga. Say that three times really fast, I dare you. Double dare you. Now, of course, the one with the longest name is also the most strongest Shikigami, and not a single user has been able to exercise it. Finally, I want to touch up on his sorcerer techniques. Now, these aren't specific to him, as other sorcerers are capable of using these techniques. So, first up is Domain Expansion, in which cursed energy is used to create a three-dimensional pocket dimension covering a specific area. He also has Chimera Shadow Garden, where a large area is flooded in shadows. Fluid shadows, I should add. Now, in this space, Fushiguro is able to create multiple Shikigami and even doubles of himself. Let's finish this video off with a little bit of trivia about Fushiguro, and probably I know nothing of this either. So Itadori is more of a TV guy, Fushiguro is the opposite as he is the type of person who loves to read, most particularly non-fiction, and surprisingly I do not like reading. In terms of food preference, Fushiguro likes any food that pairs with ginger, however he does have a dislike for red peppers. Going back to attire, his preference in clothes are the ones that he would feel most comfortable in while at home, comfortable over style guy. Fushiguro's birthday overlaps with the winter solstice, December 22nd, which is the shortest day and longest night of the year. He was also born on the cusp, thus his star sign is unclear. If he was born before midday, he is a Sagittarius, however, if he was born after midday, he is a Capricorn. Wait, do people actually really care about what sign they are? But thanks for watching, this was my video, 5 Vags about Megami Fushiguro from the series Jujutsu Kaisen. Let me know in the comments who you would like to see next. Of course, a big thanks to Hermza for joining me on this vid. His channel is great, he does lots of episode reaction vids including Jujutsu Kaisen, so make sure you check out his links in the video description below. As always, a huge shout out to Warwick, Animator22 and Ram for supporting me on Patreon, and of course don't forget to smash the like button if you enjoyed this video. Follow me on on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, links are in the description, and subscribe for more anime content. Till next time, my fellow weebs, peace!